Hey guys, happy Monday! I'm kind of losing my voice because I was screaming earlier and yeah, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Anyway, today I'm going to be doing a highly requested video. I don't know if I'm qualified to say that, but yeah. I'm going to be doing a what's in my purse video. Okay, so before I start off, I'm just going to say that I'm keeping it real. Because there is a miss in here right now. I don't think like it would be genuine if... Achilles! Shh! Excuse me, I'm recording, dog! Come here, buddy, come here! Now you can't have the cheese crackers! Hi guys, I want to be in the video too! I want to be in the video too! No, you can't kiss me, you nasty doggy! I'm... Hey guys! I don't... I don't want to kiss my auntie, but she doesn't love me! Can you shut up please? I'm trying to record. I would highly appreciate your silence. Thank you. Anyway, as I was saying, just keeping it real because my purse is a big mess right now. And I thought that it wouldn't be very genuine if I cleaned it before I made this video. So I'm just going to do it as is. Say bye. Say bye. Say bye. Okay, so to begin with, my bag is a big brown leather bag. I like big bags because I literally throw anything and everything that I need in here before I go out the door. This bag I got from Zara. I don't know if you guys have Zara's where you live, but that's where I got my bag. So yeah, I'm just going to keep going. Okay, I don't even know where I should start because there is such a big mess in here right now. Anyway, let's just dive in. <laughs> I can't dive into my purse. Okay, so first of all, hanging on the strap, I have my SpongeBob hand sanitizer. I am a germ freak. And I always have hand sanitizer on me wherever I go. So that's the first thing you would see on my purse. And then moving into the inside, which is a complete and total mess. Um, I have my case for my glasses. Just because I don't want my glasses to get squashed in the mess that I have in here. Okay, and then second of all, not most important. Um, I have to emphasize that I'm not doing this in an important basis. I'm just pulling out what I can get from my purse because it's a big mess. Okay, so I have my phone in here and my glittery case. And that's about it because you gotta have your phone wherever you go to communicate with people not just to communicate with people but to pretend to talk to someone when you're in an awkward situation come on i know you all do that we all do it's okay and then i usually carry a book with me um this is a novel that i have to read for my spanish class it's yeah i don't really have an interesting book right now that i can show you guys but i just have to read that for school and then, after that, I always have a blank notebook in my purse because... Oh, and along with the pen. The pen because I feel like sometimes you have to write things down and you don't have anything to write it with. Um, so I usually carry some paper and a pen. But I, lately, I've been carrying a blank notebook in here because when I get ideas, I will literally write them down. I feel like writing something down on a piece of paper is way more satisfying than writing it down on your phone. I don't know if that makes sense. But yeah, I just have my little blank notebook. It says little black book. How cute is that? Okay, after that, I usually carry... Okay, this is a mess. Because it's been squashed in my purse for like a week. I usually carry a snack with me. Um, This is a sprouted raw vegan gluten-free trail mix. It just has fruits, nuts, and seeds. And it's good to carry something healthy in your purse for whenever you get hungry because if you're at the mall and you get hungry and it's not time for your next meal you don't want to have like pretzels or something that's not very good for you so I like to carry healthy snacks in my purse to help me resist temptation and after that oh I don't always carry makeup with me this is a little makeup bag um, I have a few essentials in here such as pressed powder and something for my lips, um, some mascara, and then, oh, I always carry a travel size perfume in my bag because, yeah, I feel like that's one of the most essential things that I need to have in my purse. What is this? Mm, this is Stella by Toka. Toka, I don't know. Oh, it smells so good! But yeah, I think you should always have perfume in your purse because you never know when you might need it. Wink. Yeah, I have no idea why. I just went. That was weird. And then, what else do I have in here? I have a bunch of receipts in here because I just throw them in my purse because it's so big. That's one of the downsides of having a big purse. Yeah, anyway. Up next, I have my phone charger. I carry my phone charger with me because I charge my phone in the car, in the wall, wherever I am. So yeah, I think it's pretty necessary for me to carry my charger with me because I'm such a battery hoarder. Is that a word? I don't know. 
oh, this is another essential, and I don't know why this is in my little makeup bag. Must have slipped out. Is body lotion or hand lotion. I just have the Pacifica Tuscan Blood Orange Body Butter because my hands are always, always dry, and so are my legs. And I just can't handle chalky skin, so I must have this on me at all times, just in case. And what else do I have in here? Oh, I always need to carry headphones because, like I said before, when you're in an awkward social situation, it's good to have headphones because you could just put music on or watch a vlog or a show or something and be 100% fine, I promise. So yeah, headphones are another essential of mine. I have two headphones in my purse, see? Just emphasizing how important headphones are for me. And something that I always have in my purse as well is a hair tie, scrunchie, um, hair clip, whatever. Um, just because if I'm doing something, if I'm eating, for example, I don't know if this happens to anyone else, but I cannot eat with my hair down for the life of me, or the death of me, I don't know how the saying goes. But I can't eat with my hair down because it just, I don't know, I feel like I'm going to have an anxiety attack. So I just can't. I gave up on that a gazillion years ago. Oh my gosh, can we just pretend that this was never here? A Milky Way bar? I'm trying to be healthy and I have a Milky Way bar in my purse. Nice going. And then if you hear that crinkling noise, it's because, like I said, I have a bunch of receipts in my purse. <laughs> other things that I have in here. Oh, my wallet. I don't know why I hadn't showed you my wallet. This is just, I believe this is a camera or a phone case. It's from Michael Kors. I got it at TJ Maxx. Ow. But yeah, I just saw it and I saw the color and I fell in love with it. And you know what? I don't care if it's a camera case. I like it and I want to use it as a wallet. No cash. Oh yeah, I have a dollar. Oh yeah, I'll make it rain. Up next, this, I don't always carry a bottle of water with me because it's just so heavy and I don't like carrying very heavy things in my bag because it's already full. But if I'm going to somewhere that I won't be getting bottles of water, if I'm gonna be walking a lot or if it's gonna be hot, then I will certainly put in a bottle of water in my purse just because it's very important to keep hydrated. And then I'm almost done, finally. I have a recyclable bag, tote bag, I don't know what you call this, but yeah, just in case I want to go shopping and I don't feel like being wasteful and using up a, a plastic shopping bag or a paper shopping bag, then I carry a recyclable tote bag in my purse. Um, this is just the limited edition bag that you got at Paxson if you bought anything from the Kendall and Kylie collection. Yeah, I think it's cute, so I keep it in there just in case. I have a little pocket. What else is in my little pocket? Oh. How could I forget this? This is another one of my essentials. Okay, so I said I have a few essentials. One, my phone. Two, perfume. Three, hand lotion. My phone, four. Headphones, five. And then this. Like, everything is important, I guess, but this is one of the most important things because my lips get very dry. And I do have to carry lip balm with me. And more specifically, one that doesn't make my lips um, break out in allergy because I am allergic to most lip products. I don't know if you guys knew that, but yeah, I am. So this is one of the very few lip products that don't give me a rash on my lips. I know that's probably TMI or gross, either or both of the above. But yeah, so yeah, this is one of my favorite lip products. It's the Minted Rose Lip Balm. And as you can see, I will be needing to buy one of these pretty soon. And that's about it. So now I'm just going to put everything back into my purse and call this a video. I know that's probably not that interesting, but you guys wanted to see what was in my purse and I did want to make you guys happy and show you what was in my purse. So yeah, that's about it. So thank you for watching. Be sure to follow me on my Twitter, on my Instagram, and on my Facebook page so we can talk and stay in touch. Have a good week, take care, and mwah, a million kisses your way. Bye guys. Woo! What's he barking at? I just heard noise that was scary. <laughs>